My name is Michael Weeks with the Providers Council, and I want to give you a big good morning. Good morning? Great. Welcome to the Providers Council's 34th Annual Convention and Expo. Um, on behalf of the Board of Directors, our staff, and Convention Committee, we are thrilled to have you join us today for this event, an opportunity of sharing, learning, networking, and celebrating. Most importantly, we affirm our commitment to the theme of Mission Possible. This year, as you well know, has been more challenging to our sector than probably any time in recent history. In fact, probably in most of our history, it has certainly been um, a difficult time. But as care providers to thousands of individuals and families across the Commonwealth, we recognize the health of the Commonwealth is inextricably tied to the health of our sector. A state economy in recession results in more demand for services and a less financial capacity to provide it. We understand. We have been forced to close programs, which meant that clients have lost services. We have had tremendous layoffs, a loss of friends and colleagues, and some of our organizations have collapsed. But we understand that intrinsic to our success as a commonwealth is our collective performance to provide safety, hope, and opportunity to thousands seeking the chance to succeed. Now, perhaps it's a person with a disability provided vocational skills leading them to sustainable employment, or a young person seeking protection and a caring home environment to thrive, or a family evicted from somewhere to go nowhere. However, whatever, whenever life and circumstances challenge our basic humanity, our providers of care in this room have been there. And if you're not sure who they are or what they look like, I'd ask if you please turn to the person to your left or the person to your right, and let's give them a big round of applause right now. Absolutely. You want to applaud them because they deserve it, they need it, and we're so pleased that they're here today. Mission Possible encapsulates in two words the actions and deeds of an 185,000 workforce in our vast human services sector. While regulations and policies may be imprecise and cumbersome, when workload demands appear unfathomable and when funding is limited, you, with dedication and commitment, rise to accomplish mission possible. But we are not alone at all. The state's chief human service policymaker and implementer of services and reform is with us here today, and that's Dr. Judy Ann Bigby. Dr. Bigby directs a sizable portion of the state budget, although declining, I might add. But she has over 17 agencies in her secretariat that are providing services and supports to folks all throughout the Commonwealth. She's made history with the Commonwealth with the Olmstead Plan. She well understands that our challenges are immense and growing. But we will have to work together to realize true success through this current economic storm. I'd like to welcome to the stage Dr. Judy Ann Bigby, but I want you to help me by giving her a round of applause. Let's welcome Dr. Judy Ann Bigby. Thank you. 